Bitcoin, it's now or never. What's going on in the crypto space? You want to know the last information? Yes, then smash that like button because it's time for crypto news fun on the right. Crypto a tope. Today, we told you about some trouble we have in the crypto sphere. And the thing is following this thread for Kevin Svensson on X, uh, formerly known as Twitter. You can see that Bitcoin is nearly about to cross below the primary uptrend line that began at the start of 2023. So we've been following that one in TradingView. You have the link in the description below. And you know for us how important is the line of 20,888. So right now we are minutes away for seeing if it's going to resist there, if it's going to find support or we are facing the end for Bitcoin and the cryptocurrencies world again. More from Kevin Svensson X. Uh, you can see there that the stock market is coming down and you can go to TradingView heat map and you see red all over what's going on in United States, what's going on with Nasdaq. We are going down maybe because of the third line of this tweet. Michael Burry is taking massive short positions on the stock market. Why is this relevant? Why well, this is important for you? Well, because if you don't know about that, Michael Burry is this guy that knew that the market was going to collapse in 2008. And he decided to create the huge, the biggest short. And we have that movie when you can watch everything about that. So he made a lot of money because he knew uh, that the market was going to crash. Uh, we were in a huge bubble and uh, now he's saying that we are going south again. He is opening massive leverage short positions on the stock market. He has 93% of his portfolio now shorting the market on the indexes. So this is very concerning, even though uh, you have to remember, we told you here in Crypto News, fan on the right, smash the like button, that uh, he failed the last time he told us to sell because uh, the market went up again. So we'll see about that and let's see if this is true even, or maybe this is just fake news because I wrote that in Wildwire, uh, this Twitter account. Uh, you can see here the piece of information about that short, but also he's telling us that the SEC has postponed the lines for all Bitcoin ETFs approvals until 2024. And if you go to the source, you can see that that's not true. At least this is quite a clickbait or something like that. Because what the article says is that, yes, we might have to wait till early 2024, but it has no uh, reason to uh, just use the phrase that they denied till that point. It's a possibility, but it's not true. So it wasn't in August, but it might be in September. It might be in October. Remember, if not, then we have to move to January or even March of 2024. What's past videos? I told you everything about that. And remember, we had some info, some alpha, uh, some insiders saying that that ETF is going to be approved in six months. So we'll see in the future who's right. We have here Crypto Jelen telling us that any case, if we are following the last moments where Bitcoin went up, we still have to wait. You can hear, see how similar the situation is right now to 2015. And we still some months uh, to be feel like it was in that moment in order to start the crazy parabolic rise. But we are patient people. And also we take these moments for learning. Like for example, right now, maybe with our partners in CoinX, you want to uh, try what trade in future means and you can do that for free. This is a promotion from CoinX and Fan on the right. What you have to do? Well, the first riders run and do that, that go to my link and use that to create a new account. You are going to have five USDT uh, with those. You are going to operate uh, without your own margin. It's going to be paid by these five USDTs. So you won't risk your own money if you want to try. This is not forever. So you have a little time in order to ask for your coupon there, just using the link in the description. And then you have 17 days approximately in order to use it. 
if you make a good deal and get money, you'll get those five USDTs. So go there and try with CoinX in those futures. It's something for me difficult. I don't really recommend trading. Uh, you know about that. But here with our partner, now we have a chance for trying if you are curious about this and you are not going to lose money, which is I love to say in this world with mostly everybody loses everything. Remember CoinX, the exchange, the global exchange that is trying to make things easy for you. Follow them on their trading accounts in Spanish and in English in global, where you have a lot of promotion, different draws and contents, and you keep on learning, learning and earning as you can do with Rand App 2. Link also in the description with the contributor program I told you in past video. So if you want to learn about this and you don't know what's the last video and go to Rand App when we are making 5% and we have a lottery we can't lose. Good moment for the market for lending, but also we have good information there. Like for example, in Europe, we are living a celebration. The celebration is that we have already a ETF in spot for Bitcoin. So now Canada, Brazil, Europe and some other countries already we have the ETF and United States is behind us. So finally, this is pressure for United States in order to approve that ETF. Congratulations for Europe. Usually we are the worst, but today we are better than United States. So congratulations to all of us and congratulations to PayPal. They know about the future. Uh, they created PayPal at the first place and now they are going to use crypto. We told you about the stable coin. What's the last video? I told you about this, but now they are rolling out a future uh, to allow users to convert that stable coin, the PYUSD to Bitcoin and other crypto. So you can see that they are not stopping development and PayPal is a huge company out there. Also in Oman, there's a sovereign wealth fund. They move a lot of money and they just launched a 370 million hydrocool mining farm project in Salala. So we are so happy for people there in Salala and we will go there, visit the farming of Bitcoin. And we will play some Bitcoin games like this one with Lightning Network. You can play like a snake in the past and earn some money. So here you see some Bitcoiners having fun and they have giant jewel. And there you need to pay some uh, Lightning Network that afterwards you can win. So interesting. I'm going to uh, play. I will tell you how to do that. Right now, I leave you the Twitter account there, Chain Duel. And uh, from this, we move to Bitcoin and what's going on with the chart, with the price, with all this information. Again, boring time. We are in the ping pong from $30,000 to 2888 And you'll see we are going down right now. We'll find support. We'll see about that. Everything is going smoothly according to plan. This is dollar. I told you the line, the counter indicator. I'm not expert, but we keep on following the path. So we still need to be patient in August. We'll see in the weekly if we still find support in the moving average of 20 or maybe the 200. And here, the crypto market on trading view, everything mostly in the red, but say, what is this? I have no clue. I went to CoinMarketCap and there they told us that this is backed by Coinbase and some other exchanges. And this is allegedly something that makes trade indexes smoother uh, with NFTs and it's cheaper and whatever. I don't know if we need something like this, but it skyrocketed 2,700% despite the market going down. So now this is the new FOMO uh, say, I'm not going to buy it. But if you know interesting things about this and you want to share, well, just leave a comment below. Thank you very much. And remember that we have always a pump and then a dump. For example, here with this piece of information, it tells us H bar price source as Fed now at support for Hedera. But now we go to the market and Hedera is the worst of the most important ones with a 13% drop. So again, be careful with speculation and try to differentiate between speculating and investing. The market is neutral psychologically today. Anything is going closer and closer to the line we don't want to miss. 
So we'll see about that and we'll see about Dogecoin. We have now already a date set uh, for the moment that Dogecoin is going uh, in this moon mission. It's going to be November 15, 20. So we'll be uh, paying attention for that. This was announced by Geometric Energy Corporation and SpaceX in May 2021. The mission will launch with the SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket as a vehicle shared in the Nova C whatever mission, a joint mission between Intuitive Machines and NASA. Mission Dust One will include a 40 kilograms cube satellite that will orbit the moon and gather lunar spatial information using onboard sensors and camera. And there you'll have Dogecoin in the satellite. If you want to know about meme coins and about all of this, remember dextools.io, link in the description, where we follow Pepe's chart also, and we are going down. Will we find support in the white line again? We'll see in next videos. And remember that we are going to go to Galicia, to Santiago uh, on September 28th to 13th of September. You have a 30% discount in the ticket, which is, in my opinion, cheap already without the discount. But if you are one of the first riders, you will use that 30% uh, discount. And link is in the description and you will meet us there. Thank you very much. And remember, I told you about this homework you have to do. This is the on-chain summer. And again, uh, we have more and more NFTs uh, to be minted. But as I told you in the last video about this, well, this is so expensive. I try to mint Coca-Cola, still six hours till the end, but this is just like $25, just the minting. And you have to consider also the network commission. So I just minted the two first and I'm sorry, but I'm not going to uh, waste like 500 uh, euros in minting all of them. Maybe I'm wrong. What are you gonna do? Tell me in the links below uh, here that $25 0, 0.0 for Ethereum you have to spend for the Coca-Cola NFT. If you don't know what I'm talking about, just watch this video, earn money with base with a new layer. And remember that I told you that some of the DEXs created on base are going to be a success, but some of them are going to fail. Well, we have failures already. We have a hacker that uh, created a meme coin after stealing $870,000 from Rocket Trap on base. So he stole the money and he made fun creating an NFT, uh, just laughing about this. So crazy. Remember, if you want to track your portfolio, what I use is coin tracking. Link in the description, 10% discount for you. We keep on learning. We learn about base. We learn about Argentina and we learn how to send messages through Ethereum network. And guess what? I have one rider, uh, thank you very much, that already sent me a message through Ethereum. So here you have uh, the transaction. I'm going to be checking my addresses uh, to see if you send me a message there. And here you can see that 13 hours ago, I got uh, this uh, transaction. Well, this is worth $10. I told you that you can send me just 0.001 Ethereum, for example, or something like that, like $1 or less than that if you want. But he or she decided to send me $10. So thank you very much for the tip. And here we have the lovely message he or she wrote. 0x486f6c612. Uh, in any case, if you don't understand that kind of language, remember, we can translate it. So it says here, hi, Rodri, happy birthday. I send you some ETH and greetings for you. And then our motto, salud, dinero, amor, la fiesta and paz. Crypto moneda is a topic and the best is yet to come. So thank you very much for this first message so this person know, knows how to communicate through Ethereum, which is something very interesting in my opinion. As it's not interesting to be like this cat just having there uh, some cleaning. And you can see that expression means that the cat is not happy with the situation, neither with the market conditions. What about these two? Those are experts in pool but also some cheaters, they are uh, doing their best and they are playing legally, but also them 
trying to use bad techniques. What about this guy just messing around with the cats with this song that I want to buy on Amazon just today in order to have fun like him? And what about this hedge dog trying to destroy everything in the market? It's cute, but also a force of destruction and those two doge coins just chilling because it's time right now for chilling here in fad on the right where we have no more time if you want this very show the same exact show in spanish go to our primary channel fan on the right if you want more in english just wait to next show here crypto news fun on the right health money love pouring in peace and the best is yet to come crypto a tope to the moon